the narcissist's worst nightmare after they leave you. The narcissist's worst nightmare is to see you becoming successful after they have left you. The last thing they want to see is you doing better when they are no longer with you. After they have ignored and neglected you. They refuse to take notice of you. They disregarded you intentionally. They excluded you from a group, activity or benefit. They left you in a bad position without the rights or advantages that are given to other people. They left you for dead. Assuming that you were no longer effective or useful to them. But then some time goes by and you're healthy again. You've recovered from any financial problems. You're with someone new. That would be the narcissist's worst nightmare. When they left you, they might have played the victim and acted like you couldn't do enough for them. Or maybe they said that they wished the best for you. After they have used up everything that you have to offer and left you out on the street. Assuming that they're never going to hear from you again. After they were with you for all of those years and you invested all of your time, energy and money into them just for them to use it all up and treat you like you're beneath them. Once they've drained you out of everything you've got, they just move on to their new source of supply. Someone they just met the other day. They always see the grass as being greener on the other side. They always think that other people's situations are better or more attractive than their own. So they run off to this new source of supply, assuming that it's all over for you. Assuming that they're never going to hear from you again. Because they've just left you in the dust. They've taken everything you had and left you with nothing. So they assume that you're never going to do anything with your life. You're never going to be anything great after they're gone. But then some time goes by and you come back. They hear about you from a friend or they see you on social media. And then they realize that you have managed to turn your life around. They realize that you have become successful. You have met someone more successful and more attractive. Which completely destroys the narcissist. Because it is the last thing they want to see after they have left you. 
it's their worst nightmare. But it's really what they deserve after how they have treated you. This should be your motivation after they are gone. They discarded you. They left you for dead. And then they ran off to their new source of supply. Who will probably end up cheating on them. They're not going to treat the narcissist anywhere near as good as you did. But narcissists are so gullible. They are easily persuaded to believe something. So anyone can come along and sell them a dream. At least until they see you moving on and doing better without them. Only then will they realise what a big mistake they have made. Especially when they see you moving on with someone else. When they see you making loads of money. And you're living your best life for this new person you're with. You're travelling the world, eating good food driving luxury cars, you're living a comfortable life, enjoying physical ease and relaxation, having an adequate standard of living. This is the last thing the narcissist wants to see, because they want that. And they left you hoping that they would find that with someone else, but they never do. And when they see you living a comfortable life with someone else, it just destroys them. It's like they had the winning lottery ticket, but they just threw it in the trash. They didn't realise its value. And then someone else came along and hit the jackpot. When we are with these narcissists, that's our worst nightmare. Everything they do to us, the way they treat us, they don't respect you, they don't care about you, they only stick around to use whatever benefits them. But it was never about love. And that's why it was so easy for them to replace you. When they start devaluing you, that's when they are grooming other sources of supply. That's when they are preparing other people for the purpose of catering to their demands. When they start putting you down, that's when they're cheating on you. They're getting ready to discard you. And it just kills you inside. After everything you invested into them, you cared so much for them. Maybe you wanted to spend the rest of your life with them. Maybe you invested a lot financially. And then one day you just wake up. You realise that it was all a lie. All of those fake emotions. All of those false promises and future faking. None of it was real. You realise they're talking to someone else. They're trying to move on with this new person. 
And they think you're done. They think it's all over for you. They think they're never going to hear from you again. And then you come back. You come back better than ever before. You become successful. You become prosperous, affluent, wealthy, rich. You surpass any standard that they ever thought you could achieve. And you've met someone new. Someone who is more successful and attractive than a narcissist. It just destroys them. It pulls them out of their little fantasy bubble, which they created to protect their weak, fragile egos. It makes them feel stupid. And they will try to pop up in your life again. But you cannot let the narcissist come back in your life. You have to teach them a lesson. You have to let them know that how they treated you was not okay by never giving them another chance. The narcissist's worst nightmare is seeing you become successful after they have left you. That's the last thing they want to see. They want to see you fail after they've left you. They want to see you struggling in life. They want you to be miserable. So that it confirms that they made the right choice by leaving you. They don't want to deal with the shame of making a wrong or foolish decision. They cannot deal with regret. They cannot deal with a thought or idea that they let go of the one they were supposed to be with, their destined life partner. Because after they've seen your success, you set the bar for everyone they meet. They will hold their new sources to the same standard they saw from you. Which will be very difficult for them to do if you have managed to become successful. They will probably never find anyone else who is at your level. They will only experience disappointment. Well, for you, it's not going to be hard for you to find someone who treats you better than the narcissist. Someone who wants to improve your life. Someone who makes you happy. The narcissist was lacking affection and warmth. They were always putting you down. While well, most people aren't going to treat you that way. The narcissist doesn't want you to be happy. They want you to be miserable. They don't want you to succeed in life. They want you to fail. It's sad, but you need to use it as motivation to become successful, to meet better people, people who will treat you right. The narcissist will eventually find your social media, and when they see that you're living your best life without them, they will regret their decision to leave you. They will regret it for the rest of their lives. 
They will try to get over you. They will try to move on. But they will still be lurking somewhere in the shadows. They will be waiting. They will be watching you. You have set the bar for everyone who comes after you. Seeing your success will make them hold their new sources to the same standard. But they will only ever be disappointed. They're not going to find someone who's at your level. Because they let go of a winner. They let go of a vanquisher. And that is the biggest mistake they will ever make in their entire lives. They are going to regret it. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Click the bell icon to receive notifications for my future videos. Check out the new Narc Survivor website at www.narcsurvivor.co.uk where you can read my blog posts, book coaching sessions, and join a support forum. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching.narcsurvivor.co.uk Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.